from the comparative images and videos, these are angry Kenyan women trying to figure out whether their counterparts in the rest of the world use the same quality of sanitary towels. Clearly, Kenyan women seem uncomfortable with the way some brands of sanitary pads constantly cause discomfort to them. Majority of sanitary pads users have taken to social media, claiming some brands were causing general discomfort, including rashes, irritation, and burning sensation. However, Always Kenya maintains that their products are of good quality and are similar to those sold in other parts of the world. In a statement, Kenya Bureau of Standard Cabs on its part indicates I quote, Kebs has in the course of quality surveillance drawn samples for analysis for all brands of sanitary towels on sale in Kenya. 90% of all the samples complied with the standard, end of quote. These statements leaving Kenyan women with more questions than answers. Why then the irritation, burns, rashes and general discomfort for some women during and after the monthly period? Dr. Maureen Owiti, a gynecologist, says that cases of sanitary towels use related infections are common among Kenyan women. We would recommend that the sanitary towel of your choice should again be as natural as possible. If it's made of a natural fiber, it will again breathe, allow for circulation, and you're not going to get the infections. If, however, it's of synthetic fiber, you find synthetic fiber does not have that capacity and hence why people are going to get these, um, these complaints. The most common would be that they're getting a fungal infection, okay? So there'll be the itching, the irritation, burning sensation. According to the menstrual hygiene expert, symptoms of these infections can even last a lifetime. Synthetic is obviously going to be cheaper to make than a natural fiber uh, sanitary towel. Definitely, if you just think about it, if somebody's having some form of chronic irritation, some people may be likely to develop some form of, 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 of cancer. Dr. Maureen advises manufacturers of sanitary towels in Kenya to consider using cotton over synthetic fiber. If I was uh, head of a company, personally, I would go for natural fiber products, which I know at least the probability of a reaction would be much, much less. If you're using a product and you find it's giving you issues, my advice to such women would be to try to look for a product that is of natural fiber and they'll find that their, their symptoms are going to actually uh, reduce or, or, or altogether disappear. I leave it to the manufacturing team and KEBS to do their investigations and come up with a report and let us see what they say. Meanwhile, KEBS says it has initiated an investigation into the U.S. multinational Procter and Gampo's P&G Always brand of sanitary towels following consumer complaints. It's now for the manufacturers to make the cotton fiber recommended sanitary towels or for women in Kenya to choose the menstrual products they are comfortable with. Purity Museo Channel 1 News, Nairobi.